from the YouTube Dojo. This is Week Up and Lily Yu, and now Man thinks that Burger King really needs to eat our way, you know, see things our way. Ellie Cody Mueller. Ha! Welcome to Week Up, I'm Ellie Cody Mueller. Why is that my cries out? Alright, I, as usual, I have your uh, nightly dose of comedy, awkwardness, and let's be honest, plain absurd. I don't know uh, if it all makes sense, but pretty soon it will. Anyway, today's California winners are LC Dark World Gaming and Texas Gaming Videos and whatnot, Fireball, Fist Band, Edit. That's right. Dev Bob on Amps is Vigilante videos and whatnot. And Entertainment Warehouse, which is uh, vlogs and things like that. Although we're not really sure if we still around. Now, Alex K's uh, segment. Now, the, end, uh, anyway, the segment intro for, uh, for the show uh, created by Alex K will be uh, coming out in a moment or so. But first, let's talk about Burger King. The place that has more burgers than Denny. Oh, and it's true. Not all of these can be jokes, you know. Right, Adam? Not all of these uh, are good jokes, right? Yeah, that's right. Adam, i got to tell you about something that's uh, going on right now in the Burger King world. Listen to this. Its staff had to apologize to a blind customer for not letting her know that the foods that she ordered had nuts and for demanding her to read the menu herself. Which he uh, clearly cannot uh, see it. Oh, y'all they're bogus. I'm done. I know. I know, right? I mean, shame on you, Burger King. That's all, hey. that's all you're trying to do. Yeah. What's worse about it, Adam? This is it. An employee at another Burger King took photos of a customer's debit card. And it happened while the customer was ordering food at a drive through window. Right. Why would you invade a customer's privacy? Wait a minute. Who, who owns that particular Burger King? I'm just curious. I have no idea. Hmm. I have no idea either. And it's getting nuts, man. Right. I mean, Burger King. Ha! I know it uh, adds uh, great food, but come on. Can you at least teach your employees how to uh, treat your customers properly? Or at least how to see when somebody is, uh, BLIND! Hey, what if I'm too much? Uh, oh, never mind. Let's get off the topic. This is, uh, really, uh, more of my idea. Anyway. What's the category? Oh, okay. There are the top ranked things that Burger King needs, but needs right now. Number ocho, better employees. Number seven. Ah, oh god, number seven, customized menu. Number six, lower prices. Number five, a circus. No, that that's not very cash money a circus. Number four, a mo monkey. That's also not very cash money. Number three, music. I don't think this this list is getting cash money now. Number two, comedy. Eat. You're going to eat. You don't need to laugh while you eat. There's no entertainment. It's fast food. Fast food. And number one, lazy Nancy. Like I said, this isn't no freaking theater. It's a freaking fast food joint. And we'll be back after this with, some, with the Let's Talk About at these commercials and Black Violet Night. <laughs> Time to get up. Seriously, it's 6 a.m. I already turned that in. Seriously, it's due in two weeks. Ready for Christmas. Seriously, it's June. Time to 
listed TV pleasure classics in historic mono for the connoisseur or neophyte, only on Nick at Night. Carpet myth number one. You can't shop at home for real quality carpeting. Do you mind if we explode that myth? Empire has almost all the top brand names. Salem, World, Philadelphia, Galaxy, Evans Black. So buy your good carpeting at home from Empire. You'll get a great price, a terrific credit plan, a free phone or shampooer, and delivery quicker than you can say. You can shop at home for quality carpeting. 588-2300 Empire. Folks, welcome back. Well, I'm telling you, folks, this show keeps getting weirder and weirder all the time. I mean, can you name a show that's uh, twice as awkward Something as this? Made from the depths of it is time to be talking for the time. <laughs> Let's talk about it. I do believe that is talking time. It's talking time! Talking time! Talking time! English class! Even French! Talking time! Talking time! The only cure for sadness! Okay, now let's get right into it. Listen to this, okay? Burger King has issued an apology to a blind customer after the staff refused to tell the ingredients of a brownie out loud. After all old staff, now, the name of the other uh, person is uh, Medina Hall. Right. Now, after she told the staff about her nut allergy, she said, they claimed company policy meant she had to read the menu herself. She told the BBC, I was shocked. Had I eaten it and it had nuts in it, I would have had a major asthma attack and ended up in the hospital. In today's day Why are you trying to speak British, Mike? Well, whatever. She said, in today's said day and age, you'd think that, I mean, you'd think they would want to read it and get it right. Yeah. So, you, you see, people, when, when, when somebody come, come, comes in and says, hey, what's on the thing? You can't, you can't even get to, 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 to what you say, oh, you, you can't read, read it, which is the correct way. Because then they might they might be blind. <laughs> or you could be a dickhead and say, read re it yourself, you can't huh? Which, which happened here? Which that employee got backhanded? Complete. Employee. Be nice. Be like, oh, hello, sir. Well, what would you like from this fine establishment? Or from, or, or from this fine place? Now, Burger King has since said that there was no such policy, and the company is looking into this matter first. That now, employee is getting fired for all this shit. I can tell you that that much. It pays to be a good employee. That uh, much I don't. Apparently, this all took place in uh, Kent, England. So. England. Yep. What the hell? You're supposed to be polite and proper. What the f*** is going on, Chief? Wow. They did say that we would firstly like to apologize to Medina. Her experience this week is not reflective of the high standards they would expect within any of our restaurants. Mm -hmm. Smoke person continued, everyone should have an enjoyable experience in their business. We are looking into this matter first. I can also confirm that there is no such policy to refrain from reading allergen information to visually impaired customers. One who made a safe, safe, safe is just most definitely get, 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 getting fired. But oh, look at her face! You know that she. <laughs> you can't be doing this. 
You just can't. And what's worse about it is that uh, be it happy the other says the whole Burger King can offer hope Burger King I can offer more than a policy. The layers of uh, prejudice and microaggressions in this case is horrible. Mm -hmm. uh, or see, in this case are horrible. Or whatever. See what happens? When one employee wants to be a Trump, then that's what happens. The whole company has ha, ha, has to pay. And guess what? This is gonna go on that employee's resume. And guess what? He ain't probably hired ever again because he made the company do all that. Now what's worse about listen to this, okay? Now let's get Don't to the In Ohio, listen to this, a woman claims that she witnessed one of the fast food king's employees. Now what's the other talking about where came by the way? Took a picture. This is this a picture of her debit card while using the drive through window at a location in Ohio. When the when a woman complained, a manager for the restaurant reportedly discovered multiple photos of customers' debit cards on the worker's phone. Now Adam, hold on. Now, this is real. I right, this is real. So I right, folks uh Folks, listen to this, alright? Grab yourselves a uh, bag of popcorn, you know, uh, and watch this, because this is important, alright? Now, typical can disgust an employee's think clunks. <laughs> you see, they just want people, don't want to hire people no more. They just want to get college education for everything now, because of the high school dropout monsters. And it getting up for everybody by being stupid sons of bitches. They can pay you the card. That's some breathing shit. What's worse? This is the asylum, alright? Trisha Ryan used her debit card to pay for her lunch at Burger King, right? And that's in Hamilton. When she gave the card to the worker at the drive through window, she reported the card and tried to sneak a picture of the card. She said, I saw him grab his phone, I ended up hovering it over something on the counter, took a picture, and then he did some more hand work, and then he took another picture and gave me my receipt. So I said, hey, I just saw you take a picture of my card. And he's like, uh, no I didn't. And he continued to argue with me. That sounds like, uh, Ed from Good Burger. You can disgust face slash. This is why the world's going to sh because of unhonest, scummy, dirtbags mm. like this son of a bitch. What is wrong with you? Make your own money. Stop taking pictures of people's cards and shit. Damn. What's wrong with you? Get a life. This Get a job. You have a job and you're still stupid. Wow. Mm. Disgusting ass people. Disgusting. It's not her fault that you're in a dead end job that you have to sell people. Stop! Get a real job if you need money and you have to sell the people. Why are you stealing? For what? The at new work! The UK game? At work! My goodness gracious, no, at work! I cannot stand people that steal. Just work harder. Sweat! If you ain't sweating, then you don't deserve the money. And then obviously, he ain't sweat sweating enough. And instead of sweating, he's, he's putting trying pictures to on the lie. ground with the car. He's trying to cheat. He's trying to take pictures of people's credit cards. And he's trying to steal deplorable behavior. I'm going to spit with every fucking bird I pay now. Every bird, billable. Every bird I pay now will be spit. It's ridiculous. But no. You can't be doing that. You can't. Dad, did you hear that? That's gonna go on your record. Wow. We were talking you about the two Burger King uh, employees. Uh, no, one uh, didn't uh, read the menu to a blind customer. Nice. No, and nice. the other one took no. pictures of uh, These customers. People are stupid. Store. Nut job. I'm telling you. If you know a friend that 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 likes to do that shit, let me let me do something. Come. 
fucking stop them! They're gone, they're not gonna get a job from that behavior, I swear to God! Well, I'll write that one. 